229,000 square feet. This is the first high school from the bottom up of a design um, for over 50 years, so it's a big deal. This is the main stairwell as we go to the lower level. The board really wanted to look at in an innovative design to high school and what high school could be. High school students, uh, many times, I mean, they're too, they don't know what they want, especially coming in as ninth graders. So our goal is to make sure that they do have a unique experience, that they have um, many different opportunities to find out what their interests might be and connect them to different opportunities, even outside of the school. It's more of a college-like atmosphere as far as students um, can utilize all the spaces in the building with their teachers to be able to work collaboratively. How many opportunities do you get to be in a situation where you start a school from scratch? There's no history, there's no legacy, there's no traditions. We get to form all that. The students get to, they got to help pick the colors, they got to help pick the mascot, they're gonna pick the themes, they're gonna pick how the school runs. It goes to what Greenville County has been pushing for for years is the college and career ready. And you know, a lot of it back then was, well, you kind of did the college stuff in the school and maybe you did the career stuff in the career center. And now we have a facility where you can do it all, all in one facility. The kids are gonna start here as freshmen and they're right into the career ready. They're gonna be taking the engineering, they're gonna be taking the mechatronics, the digital arts, whatever it might be. They're jumping right into careers. They get a real chance to see if they like those careers. They can explore, they can try different things that suit their interests. But our school is still um, a traditional high school. We have all the arts programs that a well-established high school would have. To begin with, we should have about 320 um, ninth grade students that will come in as our first inaugural class. And then each year we'll add a class until we're right around at 1,000. But a building is just a building without the people inside of it that are gonna use it and utilize it. So I can't wait to stand right here as they're walking in and see them on the first day of school and welcome them into our building um, and get the, just get this journey underway.